very intense and passionate training camp. Dismiss that body shot. That is a strong uppercut there. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Good combination to the body. A stabbing right hand comes in by Money. Some serious damage done on that power shot to the head. Dropped his hand, paid a fight. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his own. Move, move. A little volume punching to the body there. Showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. A little head hunting with the right. Last 10 seconds of this first round. Good shot to the head with that right hand. Mayweather's good, clean, and effective punching damaged his opponent in that last round. Can't just move around. You gotta move the hands. Right, let's go. Listen. That's the best. It's all yours, baby. But you gotta keep working. Keep working in this. Here we go. Round two is underway. Now committing to that jab, straight hand, and it works out. Money's giving his opponent headaches here now. He's throwing punches, but he's able to block them away. of a fight, Teddy, these very early moments, how much in your training career will you stress to a guy to try to go to the body? Very much, because it sets up things later on, and it takes away things that he's trying to do. You know, he's trying to move his upper body. You go downstairs, it takes a lot of that away. Ninety seconds to go here in this round. Rusher's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. Lance flush with the two-punch combo by Crusher. Just 10 seconds to go here in the second round. Must be the punch of the day. Both guys bringing home uppercuts. And that round comes. Some guys would rather not take those chances. And round number three is underway. Nice block by Money. Oh, 
he just misses with that headshot. Good job staying away from the danger there. Wow, what an uppercut. Oh, what an exchange. a moment here as you see the step back counter punch where you realize this is the sweet science not just some raw savagery swinging out there look at the little subtleties here joe what he does is he forces him into a position to stop the punch and then when he stops steps back makes a miss and comes right back Shot blocked. He was waiting for his opponent, just waiting for an opportunity, and he found it. The counter punch by Crusher. Really, a lot of consistency from him with the right hand. Scores with the uppercut. Crusher's got to be feeling the sting of that big, powerful hook. Ten seconds to go in this round. Left hook, right hand, well done, especially to the body. And round three comes to an end. Get some water. Now look, you can score punches with your jab. Okay, easy. I need you to string together your punches. Always good to get off to a good start, and that's exactly what he's done tonight on Teddy's scorecard, sweeping the first three rounds. Rusher's not firing off the big power punches. I gotta wonder why. Sometimes a guy is making a solid agreement in his mind that maybe if I don't hit him hard, he won't hit me hard back. He's not confident enough now to throw the punches without worrying about what a comeback at him. Mayweather's on the wrong end of a destructive uppercut. Boy, sharp two punch combination by Money. He comes with the straight right hand. Mayweather's bang by a big uppercut. Oh, and they decide to trade there. Nice, nice. You see, he comes over the top with that right hand. A real solid shot. Crusher's going to think about the next time he throws a punch because he just got hit by a good, solid counter. Unload! Unload! Back to the bottom! Money's blocking ability is doing well for him there. Fine look at right hand by Money. Rusher's lack of defense right now is showing up. His opponent's scoring with the right hand consistently. Yes, he found the target for that early on, and he just stayed with it. Nothing fancy. Money's effectiveness really. Nice work, guys. Keep fighting smart and keep busy. Don't take a break. Another round, will it go in another one-way direction? It's been a one-sided fight so far tonight. Move your head. Mayweather's doing well, sticking to a game plan on the outside. That's a nice right hand that time by Money. Close to him. Oh, I like the way he went to the body with that hook. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. There's the combo downstairs. A 
stabbing right hand by Crusher. Halfway into round number five here. Good fighting, snapping shot by Crusher. Mayweather's opponent has to be thinking to himself, how can I get this guy off of him? How can he, Teddy? Well, the one thing he can do is don't wait until he's on you. <laughs> it's too late then. As he's coming forward, sidestep him a little bit before it's too late and catch him. But he sends it right back. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Oh, a good right hand by Money. Final 10 seconds of this fifth round. Rusher's got to like where he's headed right now. Now, your scorecard still has him trailing, but he did win that last round. Yeah, I think so. I mean, before it looked like he was just trying to, you know, negotiate with his opponent. Now negotiation is over. He's trying to just go through. And the way he's at, I think that's the right attitude. Got to be accurate to send the combination to the body, and he does that. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Great right was lined up, but he missed. Crusher's doing a poor job here. This is not how he wants this fight to be. He wants to be winning this fight as an inside fighter. That's not how it's playing out. Yeah, he needs to be on the inside. But you know what? Maybe he doesn't want to be there. Can... And a power shot lands, and all of a sudden it turns the table. A little slow with that jab, and he got caught the right hand. Focus. Good scoring shot. It was a straight right. Trying to cage him in that corner right there. Good work, toe to toe there. Both fighters got in on him. Comes right back with some offense of his own. Right to the belt line. Mayweather's crushed by that shot to the head. Oh, he took some damage, but he gave some back with the right hand. Money's left, landing well. Left to the body. Russia's trainer right now. Pull this fight out. You may be trailing. There's not much left, but it's still there. You can still go out there and get this win. Each man able to land an uppercut. By sending more than one at him now, the combo to the head. Money's doing a really nice job here. I mean, putting his punches together. This is what you're supposed to look like as an offensive fighter. Yes, it is, especially when you have a guy in front of you putting the earmuffs on. You know, you cover up the way that his opponent is. You're supposed to put him together. One or two are going to be blocked. But when you put them together like that, you're going to get through. Good return fire that time. Right hand downstairs. Solid right by Money. Rusher's combination punching is working well here. Submitting to the body work now. He lands the right hand. Tried the hook, didn't get it. Rusher's scoring with that right hand. Money's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Got to try to do better than that. He missed with that hook. They trade shots. He comes back with a right hand. 
Money's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Smart punch right there, the uppercut worked. And now he's targeting upstairs. And round seven comes to an end. No doubt about it, you are losing this fight. You know, it's not always as simple as who throws more punches. As we start round number eight, we look at your scorecard. Money's been the more effective fighter. The punches he is throwing, those punches are getting things accomplished. And he's also proven something that I've said before, that sometimes aggression is a state of mind. You know, it's not really a physical state. And that's what he's doing. You know, he's fainting him a little bit. He's controlling the outside. He's not always walking forward. But he's doing what he wants to do and making his opponent do what he wants him to do. Oh, good defense there. That was a fine block by Crusher. Crusher's missing the mark by a mile. That just was nowhere to be found. I like that step back right there. Just enough to be out of danger, but still close enough to then land the counter. Well, that's what happens when you have that kind of experience. You're calm enough to know that range. Know where the beginning of the punch and the end of the punch is. 90 seconds to go, halfway through round eight. Money's defense is now serving him well. Nice job blocking that punch. Hooks on the inside. Good look at right hand after he got hit. Mayweather's rocked by a huge hook to the head. Solid straight right hand. Firing off the uppercuts. Great exchange. Able to cover up that gut. More than one punch downstairs. That can be damaging. Yeah, I like what I see. I love what I see, baby. Another round exactly like that. The ninth round is here. Good one, too, by Crusher. Nice block that time. It was intended to the head. Getting the job done with hooks on the inside here, Teddy. Well, right now, if I'm the opponent, you know what I do? I catch that hook on my glove, and bang, I shoot back a straight right hand. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by Crusher. Crusher's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. Punch! Punch! He gets to him with an uppercut. Oh, there it is. Money's gone down. Oh, wow, what a shocker there. I should be grown for that. tough spot here. Don't get fooled Don't do just that, thinking he beat the count and everything's fine. And I'm not so sure that he can grab. So what you gotta do now, if you're a trainer, the way you taught him in the gym is you don't wanna go grab because you might leave yourself open. Move your head when he comes to you, then you grab him. Very accurate two-punch combo by Crusher. There's the head shot, but he parries it away. Mayweather's feeling the effects now of that hook. Well-targeted right hand by Crusher. 
Crusher is so dangerous with that accuracy. A two-punch combination landing. He's got his guard up really well that time, and it protects his head. And that's the end of round nine. Crusher's down on your scorecard. I snuck a peek at your scorecard. He's down on your scorecard. But it's still a close and competitive fight, a fight that he's very much alive in. Yeah, he is, but he's got to go about it like the fight is up for grabs. He can't start saying, hey, you know, I think I'm a little bit ahead, because that's a good way of getting yourself disappointed in anything in life. He better still go after it. Smart, but go after it. Mayweather's showing us a side that we haven't seen before, and obviously the knockdown brought that about. Yes, it did, and he's hoping that right now that it confuses the opponent. Don't be so sure he's going to stay with this, Joe. He might just be doing it for a diversion tactic. You know, just to survive right now, maybe buy him a little bit of time, confuse his opponent, keep his opponent at bay, and then go back to what he knows best. We'll look out for that. Oh, and he's going to the body well. Big shot. Perfectly executed. 